Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel, guys. Today I am going to make a new video. So please, sabarakara, sarakabar, sabarakarai, sarak, sarakab, whatever. Please, sab, sarab. Uh, I want to reach one million likes. So please, sarap, sabarak, sarapakara, sarapakara, sarapaka. Okay, thank you. So, good day, Obia friends. I'm here to announce to Obia friends what I saw when I was in Johannesburg, USA. This is what I saw exactly, and this is how everything happened. A friend of mine named Mark uh, Brogan, who works as a lab scientist, the guy invited me to his birthday party. So as he probably what he does, he spends almost 80% of his time at work. So the guy decided to fix the birthday party at uh, his at his workplace. So when on the 25th, yes, the birthday took place on the 25th. So that day when 25th January 2022. So. When I got to the factory, I noticed there are a series of unfamiliar things there. I saw a lot of plastic bodies. I saw a lot of uh, uh, things, plastic, a lot of clones. So on the second, so I decided to walk around the company and uh, you know see some things there because everything they are not familiar. So there I decided to walk around and. Uh, while I was walking around on the second floor, I saw this. So I decided to take a few pictures and a video of this in the kind of plastic herd. While I was about to leave, two security men from that facility showed up and uh, they told me that their manager demands to talk with, with me. So I had no choice but to follow them to the manager's office. Then the manager's office, the manager told me that uh, they saw me through the camera trying to um, snap in pictures on, on some of their models there in that facility. So I told them that, I told the manager that that's nothing. So he said that there was, uh, he told me that there's a lot of secrets in that company, that they have a lot of privacy. And I, I, that I should hand my phone over to them since I have already snapped the picture. So I asked the manager what are they going to do with my phone and he says that they are going to eliminate my phone, my cell phone, which I had all my contacts inside there. So I said no and I insisted on giving them the phone. After some time, some arguments, the security man there decided to start quarreling with me. And uh, after some time, they the manager instructed them, instructed them to lock me up in a room and uh, while I was in the room, yes, there in the room I was still with the phone. So they locked me up there and uh, I stayed there for like six minutes. So while I was in the room I decided to send the video to one of my friends WhatsApp account. So a few months later, the manager showed up with my friend and uh, in that room, my friend came to me, Mark, yes, his name is Mark uh, Brogan. So he came to me and started uh, explaining to me that there are certain rules in that company, in that uh, facility that he forgot to, that he should have told me earlier that I should give the phone over to them. So I had no choice but to do what my friend told me. So when I handed the phone over to them, the manager instructed the security man to eliminate the phone, so the cell phone, yes. So that was a uh, 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 taking of phone. So while, while I was talking, the, the security guard there decided to uh, chew through the phone inside. Uh, he brought out something that looks like a bowl well filled up with a uh, white chemical. So he threw my phone inside that chemical and the phone melted up instantly. So before I left the company with them, after everything happened, including the birthday, the manager came to me and uh, he told me a lot of things. He said that uh, let 
that he's wanting me not to tell on what happened that day or he's gonna make my life a living hurt. So um, after everything, I went home that day and uh, I went to my friend's house and I sent the video to his WhatsApp account and I recovered the video. So the purpose of this video is to inform my POVs that maybe Buhari, let me not cross the words name here, or someone or some of the enemies, IPUB enemies, are plotting evil against the Nandikan. So um while I was in the company, I also while I was in the facility, yes, I also overheard some employees there discussing about plastic head surgery. I didn't know what that means exactly. So I also saw a blueprint there at the facility some NNPs, yes, blueprints, which I will be posting in the next video, and um, I will also be posting. Oh, I'm sorry. So I will also be posting uh, the address of this company located in Johannesburg, Jersey. So, um, so there's some of you that uh, some of you who are doubting this video could go there and see for themselves or search around the web. So I, what I pray for is for God to protect and guard the non our leader, the IPOB leader. And uh, thank you all. And please subscribe to this channel to help that uh, lead to our reach 1 million subscribers. And uh, thank you. See you in the next video. I love you all and I love Biafra. Thanks.